Culture is not just important. It is extremely important that a great vision can be destroyed by unhealthy culture. I've heard it said like this, that culture eats vision for breakfast. And so you have to understand that if you're creating an unhealthy culture in your church or organization, your church, your organization is not going to grow. And so we have to identify this. So what is culture? Well, culture is where what you say and what you do actually meet. It's what people feel and experience inside your church and your culture. It's more than just words. I have a friend that works in Israel and he says the Jewish culture kind of has this understanding. They say, don't tell me you love me. Spend a day with me and I'll tell you whether or not you love me. That it's what you feel or experience. So how do you develop and identify a healthy culture inside your church or organization? Well, I believe there's four things to work on. Number one, you need to clarify things. If someone was going to describe your church or organization, what would they say? Or what would you want them to say? What are the list of things you want to be described about your church or organization? Those are your values. You have to be very clear on the goal and the target you're shooting for. Number two, you got to quit talking about it and you got to start doing it. That the culture you desire in the future starts by you modeling it in the present. That you got to start moving forward. Quit making excuses and start doing it. And if your volunteers and staff are not doing it, it's either because you're not clarifying the values enough, you're not modeling it enough, or you're not talking about it enough. And so create it now so that you can experience it later. Number three, understand it takes time. That culture is not built overnight, but what you do consistently, month after month, it is something that births through a process. And so don't stop because you get discouraged. You keep with your values and sooner or later, it will catch on. And number four, celebrate. You have to celebrate the wins. People repeat what gets celebrated. So when you encourage and celebrate people living up to your culture, you will see them modeling it over and over again. Remember, great vision is destroyed by unhealthy culture. Boom!